Hello my babes, how are you? If you're new, how welcome, my name is Michelle and this is another channeling energies reading. Um, you guys wanted me to read about like what people call the end of the world. So with this said, uh, let's see what the universe has for you guys. I want to remind you guys that my readings have no date. They are divinely guided. Everything has free will. Even the channeling readings that I do, this is just for your entertainment purposes only and everything said I mentioned is allegedly the from beginning to end. So with this said, first of all, for those who don't know, People have been talking about the end of the world and the end of times. First of all, I don't feed into getting you scared because I do feel like if when you're scared, you cannot do nothing but just hide. And that is not the purpose of none of my readings. First of all, the world's been ending for a long time. Why am I telling you this? Okay. <clears throat> Temperature changes. Weird air earthquakes happening. The world has been telling us for a long time that's been ending. You don't need a book to tell you that. No. Second of all, what is the things that are going to be different for us from now on? There's going to be a new wave of COVID, okay? So if you thought this was done, no, there's a new wave of COVID. Now, this new wave of COVID is like, um, I will say the son of the daughter of the original COVID into where it's deadlier and more difficult. It does not only attack your breathing system, it also, in a way to perform, attacks your brain. Something connected to that brain that can like eat it away into where it could happen overnight and then you're dead. So that's one of the things that we're going to be facing, a new wave of COVID. Okay, that's one thing. Another thing is, there's going to be a big structure change in the world, allegedly, right? Into where Every single country is struggling with their financial situation, okay? It's nowhere that you can go that's better than the other, right? There's going to be more homelessness coming. There's going to be more difficulties for us to make a living, okay? Anybody who's saying, you know what? I'm going to become an influencer. It's going to be hard as hell to start now to become an influencer, okay? So with this said, these are the things. Is more homelessness coming there's going to be a wave of unemployment, okay? And there's going to be allegedly so much unemployment. And I don't know where you're watching me. This is not a country specific. This is the world, okay? Allegedly, there's going to be so much unemployment that there's not going to be enough money to fund unemployed, unemployed people, right? Now, allegedly here, <clears throat> there's going to be uh, borders closing again, okay? Borders are going to be closing because of this new COVID, this new, what I consider COVID, new virus hitting the world again we're gonna go into allegedly again shut down they're gonna close like what happened back in 2020 is gonna happen again now allegedly people are gonna take it worse this time because people already know what happened in the past so people are gonna be like very scared trying to fight this but it's not gonna work it's not gonna work now for those shopping target is gonna close a bunch of stores Walmart is going to close a bunch of stores. A bunch of your favorite stores are going to close unannounced, out of nowhere, and they're going to become online. Why? Retail, physical retail is dying. So allegedly, if you're working in retail and you are considering to find a new job, I will highly recommend you to maybe start considering to get that. Because what is going to come now is warehouse jobs. Okay? Allegedly, AI. AI is going to be taking a lot of people's jobs. This is from people who, let's say, secretaries and hospitals, like basic, basic jobs that you think, oh, they cannot take it. Yes. Allegedly, every person who works in a store in retail, let's say, for example, fast food, they're not going to need a, serve, uh, uh, a person on the window. That's going to be AI. Okay. They're not going to need a person in the counter. That's going to be AI or a computer. The same thing will happen with every single thing that had a job for secretary. Secretary jobs are going to be obsolete. This is going to come around 2025, okay? This is around the globe, not just a country, okay? So this is the thing that needs to be said, okay? Okay? Now, more speculations or more aliens, more life is going to be brought up. And the fun thing is that they're going to be bringing up these conversations when we are talking about real problems, other problems. There's a lot of readers there telling you there's going to be a shutdown. There's going to be uh, uh, the, the lights are going to go off. This is not going to be something permanent. It's going to be something that can last even a day. Okay. Why? 
because they're short staffed. There's going to be a lot of people laid off. The people that take care of like the electricity is going to be laid off, especially in the U.S. And they're going to actually, again, shortage in jobs, laying off a lot of people. Okay. A lot of people are going to be laid off because why? This difficulties to get a livable wages. There's just difficulties in the economy, period, all over the world. Now, do you need to worry about the zombies? No. Can you do anything about it? I mean, you cannot worry about it. It's just getting prepared. You know what I'm saying? There's big changes for the world coming. Economy, new viruses. It's not the end of the humanity. It's not the end of the world. This is just the new reality that we're going to have to live in. Okay? People owning houses is going to be a rare thing. Okay? The rent still going up. Okay? People are going to have to make decisions here. Okay? Child care is going to be barely, you're going to be, you cannot even afford it. You won't be able to afford it. Okay? The big changes when people talk about October 4th, that's not going to be just October 4th. There's going to be a lot of things happening in the internet that because of the waves of the solar thing going on are affecting our internet because the planet, the world is changing. So be used to carrying cash a little bit here and there because a lot of times throughout the years, a lot of the ATMs, a lot of the computers are not going to work. Okay? This is just channeling it. Now, is that a punishment of any sign? No. That's not it. It just happens. If you read astrology, if you read what's out there, you will understand. You cannot blame everything to a book. You cannot live in fear. And I just hate tarot readers and people in general that like to fear feed you fear so you give them a, a view and you'll be like oh my gosh okay worry about it today what are you going to do i don't even need the cards for that so be ready for changes adjust humanity has been adjusting since they freaking won okay we can adjust to anything or then the kids are coming now they can adjust they cannot miss what they never seen we need to adjust too there's going to be a moment that gas is going to lower it. It's going to be cheap and affordable. Groceries, let me tell you, food is going to go low too, eventually. Okay? Then this situation that's happening because, again, our rent is going to be up. Right? That's the main thing. Car mortgages are going to go up. Because the world is trying to fix itself economy but they don't understand that it's not going to be the, the case but moving from that food is going to be more affordable to have the internet is going to fail a little bit more here and there carry more cash hygiene have it always because there's a new virus coming there's a new lockdown coming in 2025 it's going to last longer or shorter shorter okay there's not going to be, there's going to be, um, <clears throat> again, computers taking over some people's jobs. Basic, basic jobs, receptionist, again, customer service, retail, all of that is going to go, most of it, online. The jobs are going to be more warehouse jobs, okay? If you want to become an influencer, it's going to be hard as hell. If you want, if you were paying child care, you know, like daycare or whatnot, hard as hell. A lot of people will have to force themselves to stay at home. The new thing is having your own business, working from home, unemployment rising up. Be careful with your money. Get used to the internet failing here and there because of the waves of the universe. It's not the end. You're not going to die. You're going to be just fine if you take care of yourself. You cannot believe everything you say. A lot of conspiracies are taken out of context. Okay. 
that's pretty much it. There's gonna be changes and some sort of loss. Yes, there's gonna be changes. Adjust. But for whatever is coming for the world, all the things that I'm telling you, you're gonna see it by 2025. And you saw it today in 2023. It's just about adjusting. You have been doing it since forever. So, no, it's not the end of the world. I'm a psychic. I can see it. I can feel it. I'm giving you info. If you say, oh, I've seen this in the news, then why are you here? Why are you here? Then continue with your day then. But the biggest changes is a lot of computers taking people's job, especially retail, especially receptionist. And let me tell you, your favorite big chain stores are going to close and they're going to become warehouses. They're not going to disappear. They're going to close. They're going to become warehouses. Okay. And soon, whenever you want to call a customer service agent, you're not going to be talking to an agent. You're going to be talking to a computer. So that's pretty much it technology the future have you not seen any movies so at this point just adjust don't stress out carry some cash here and there and that's it nothing that think about it people who were here in 1902 if they were to see us today they're gonna go crazy because they consider us out of this world you see what i'm saying we're just the new era getting used to the upcoming era. And kids and upcoming babies are going to see us as like, it's not the big of a deal. So listen to me what I'm telling you. Don't feed into fear. Don't stress out and just adjust. So I hope you guys liked it. Again, this was what I get, what I channel. The year 2025 is going to be the biggest change for all of us all around the world. In year 2025 towards 2026, that's going to be the year that there's going to be some whispers of the Ukraine, Ukraine and Russia war being over. And then there's going to be an upcoming whisper of European places starting a new war. But that's not going to be for real, for real. That's going to be whispers. And eventually we'll know where it goes. But this is the end like i said before please like and subscribe tell me if you want me to do more readings like this and other subjects uh please follow me on instagram as i tend to follow back you can follow me on tiktok you can find me on facebook if you want to get a personal reading please check out my website yeah.